Hello, this is Adil from adilphotography.com. Um, today is a quick tutorial how to enhance the a lens flare or actually add it if you don't have it. So for for instance here, I have it, but it's pretty small. I don't, you know, it's can't really see it. So um, we're gonna try to get it in post processing here using Photoshop. So first of all, I'm gonna drag this big this picture over here to Photoshop and open it up it's still on raw that's why I got the camera raw but all right just to stay on the safe side they're always gonna duplicate my background just to stay safe you know using command J control J in PC and I'm gonna go to render lens flare and then I'm just gonna change, you know, choose the lens type. I always try, I, I, you know, you can experiment with these, but I, I, you know, uh, the the 50 to 300 zoom tends to work for me the best. So I'm just gonna do 121 percent. Can always go back and change it, but hit OK. There we go. So that's what we have. Um, I do not like the red hell over here the red silk circle so we're gonna try to get rid of it so first of all what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go control command Z control Z and PC I'm gonna go and create a new layer over here then go to edit I'm gonna fill it up with with black so I'm gonna go to fill you know here use black hit OK then I'll go back to filter and then lens flare click on lens flare because that's the last thing we did here in the in, in the, the function filter um so there is a lot of red over here so i'm gonna try to get rid of it so what i'm gonna do is go to hue saturation go to reds and then reduce the saturation a little bit so i think this is this probably yeah it's too much this is good right here all right yeah, that's good. Control E, so we can merge it down like that. Then I'm gonna change one of the blend modes. I'm gonna change the screen blend mode. Boom, here we go. So here's the before, here's the after. I really like it a lot. So, I mean, you can experiment with other um, type of lens flares over here. You can experiment with this guys and see what works for you best but this to me to me the 50 50 to 300 and effect behind it is actually pretty cool um, so yeah uh, then you can always measure it down flatten it and then you have a pretty good picture I really like this a lot um, thanks for watching and uh, if you like it give it a, a like <laughs> and um, looking forward to make more videos thank you